Welcome to our Glory Globe TV. Here's the breaking news. Yes, internet and telephone services collapsed across the Gaza Strip on Thursday for lack of fuel. The main Palestinian provider said bringing a potentially long-term communications blackout even as Israel signaled its offensive against Hamas could next target the south of the territory where most of the population has taken refuge. Meanwhile, Israeli troops for a second day searched Sifa hospital in the uh, north for traces of Hamas. They displayed guns they say were hidden in one building but have yet to release any evidence of a central Hamas command center that Israel has said is concealed beneath the complex. Hamas and staff at the hospital Gaza's largest deny the allegations. The military said it found the body of one of the hostages abducted by Hamas, 65 year old Yehudit Vaisi in a building adjacent to Sifa where it said it was also found assault rifles and RPGs. It did not give the cause of her day. The communications breakdown largely cuts of Gaza's 2.3 million people from each other and the outside world worsening the severe humanitarian crisis in southern Gaza even as Israeli airstrikes continue the war. International pressure is growing on Israel to allow process in fighting to let in aid with food, water and electricity increasingly search and UN officials saying relief efforts are endangered by fuel shortages. Most of Gaza's population of 2.3 million is crowded into southern Gaza including hundreds of thousands who heeded Israel's calls to evacuate to the north to get out of the way of its ground offensive. If the assault moves into the south, it is not clear where they would go as Egypt refuses to allow a mass transfer onto its soil. BNZ Report, Glory Globe TV, Delhi, Bharat.